Eric says, I've Eric. watched every episode, I believe, cool. and have learned a lot of stuff about Ubuntu. I have been having some trouble getting surround sound to work at Ubuntu. I'm running 9.04, uh -huh. and I have a Creative Sound Blaster Auto GSE. I've okay. tried to, uh, Google, as I normally do when I'm trying to figure something out, but I've had no luck. Hopefully, you'll have some insight into this problem. Link included to see the exact sound card, although I don't Ooh. think it should be too necessary. But here's the link, and it's Well, the Auto uh, is uh, it's a quarter in or uh, an eighth inch hmm. output for each channel, right? Hmm. If I'm not mistaken, so I can bring up that link though and mm -hmm. see what it is that you're. It's off soundblaster.com. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I'm just bringing up that email for you here. There we go. Creative Sound Blaster. Mm -hmm. Audigy Value. Here it comes. There it is. Yeah. See, it's just the eighth-inch outputs. Mm. One for each channel. Mm -hmm. So, so first things first. You notice with this card that there's only four four. Uh, input output type things because what happens with these value cards is that the jacks are actually shared so what is a microphone port could also be the subwoofer port it hmm. depends on how you configure it so watch out for that hmm. because that could get confusing if you use a microphone things like that essentially now I haven't used surround sound on my Ubuntu box for a while because you know just the nature of my my studio now it's like where would I put surround sound, right? So, but I used to have it, and I used to have a very similar setup with the Sound Blaster Live card, and um, it's pretty simple to set up, to be honest with you. Once you get, once you get the card installed and it's working, and you've got the the left and right channel coming out of green, then what you can do is uh, bring up your sound options. So, right click on your your little volume control up here, and go open volume control. It's going to bring up your, your mixer, which everybody's pretty familiar with. It's pretty straightforward. But you'll see that I've just got like PCM, which is my wave device or audio uh, mix kind of thing. Mm -hmm. And there's really not any configuration options here for surround sound. Mm -hmm. So what I need to do, because this is all very default stuff, I just go into preferences. And there's a few things there that I need go. to turn on. I need to turn on surround sound. I need to turn on my center channel. And I need to turn on LFE, which is my, my bass channel, mm -hmm. the subwoofer. So that's going to activate those three channels in such a way that now you can see, see how these are right now, they're uh, by default, they're down at nothing. So if you plug in speakers to those right now, uh, by default, there's no sound coming out of those. Center has got something coming out. Hmm. But uh, once you unmute those, you can increase the volume of each of these channels, and you will be able to uh, hopefully get the sound the way that you want. So you can tweak it. You can kind of you know, bring up one channel and kind of get a feel for how it sounds and uh, figure out you know, how you want to position your speakers and things like that. But more than likely, that's all there is uh, to getting that set up for you. So let us know, because I'd like to know if, that, uh, if that's found and, and, and works for you. Mm -hmm. I should mention, Eric, uh, and thank you for this uh, VK7HSE in the chat room, just saying, uh, just so you know, the info that you're giving right now, speaking to me, is going to be a little different in Karmic, because the mixer has some major changes with the newer version of Pulse Audio. Mm. So keep that in mind if you get into Karmic 9.10 mm. of, uh, of Ubuntu or Kubuntu or any of those, things might change. Uh, and uh, we'll certainly be willing to get into that for you as well uh, down the road. So That was actually okay. Unfilter. Oh, Unfilter asking the question. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Eric, nice to have you here. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. That Hope that helps, that okay? Great. Give it a try. Let us know. Yeah. And, and play around with which jack you want to plug in each set of speakers to because you might find that surround is coming out of where you think the sub should be and just don't be afraid to kind of mix it up and, and see how you can get it to sound. Um, can we pop back to unfilter for a second? Yeah, for sure. Um, I tried checking all playback volume options in volume control, and if I mute analog front and turn up the rest all the way, I still hear nothing from the back speakers hmm. or any at all. You've got PCM up and everything. It's, it's it's a challenge for me to walk you through it without actually having access to the hardware. Hmm. But play around, like look around, try it out. Uh, you might do some uh, searching in the forums and things for items such as uh, maybe perhaps switching from Pulse Audio to uh, to Alsa or something along those lines. OSS. Try different drivers. Try can. You know, change your change your audio drivers. Uh, let's see here. Go into uh, sound. So preferences, sound. You'll see that my sound playback is set to auto detect, which is probably going to default to 
uh, to my Pulse Audio. But you can try uh, any of these other drivers on your card. Try the open source sound server. Uh, they're the open sound server, ALSA. Try a couple of different things, and each one, you know, see if it is going to change anything for you. Yeah, and Filter says it's set up as ALSA now, I believe. Okay, so try Pulse Audio. Mm. Just, you know, if one doesn't work, try the next, and, and mm. so on and so forth. That would be the first thing to try.